I think I'm gonna go with ultra rare manifest. Yeah, let's go with ultra rare manifested. Here we go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I see. Oh. oh! What up, Rep Pack? It's your boy here, Marcus, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys aren't, you know the drill. <sighs> Wanna see me flip the camera? Wanna see me do it again? <laughs> yeah. Flip! Krakatawa! It's about to get a whole lot brighter, Rep Pack, because your boy is here, and today, guys, we are actually in the collectibles room. I'm not gonna tell you what the title of this room is quite yet. I want you guys to comment down below what should we name the whole collectibles room, but for those of you guys that are new on this channel, we collect everything from the late 90s, early 2000s, and on this channel, we're also trying to create the world's biggest SpongeBob SquarePants and also Nickelodeon collection. And in this room, that's where we're storing a bunch of it. But the thing is, is right now, you see it's a little bit under wraps. I mean, maybe give him a little peek up here real quick. Hold <laughs> oh, on, hold oh, on, down. You can't go that way too far, okay? Don't go past here, okay? okay. Oh, uh, oh. Don't, don't, don't! Okay. See the blue fucking line? Don't cross it, okay? Right. This is the vicinity of which we're working in, okay? <laughs> Everything else is under construction right now, guys. I am super freaking tired. Not just that I'm cold, because it's been raining like crazy. I've been in here working on this room and also trying to get the stuff done for ADHD's life and also ADHD's world, which are my other two channels on screen if you guys don't know about them already. But what we're gonna be doing right now guys we got to add something really awesome to the collection today and that is spongebob related and it was sent over by mighty jack so link will be down below thank you so much to mighty jack for sending this over i couldn't believe it i actually ended up ordering it myself and they reached out to me telling me that you know they wanted to be a part of the channel so now whenever some of the awesome spongebob and nickelodeon mighty jack stuff comes out we should just be getting it as soon as it comes out so i'm really excited but without further ado let me show you what we're opening it's in this box right here okay and the reason why we're opening this up in particular right now is because we're actually working on this section over here and I really really want to add these into this section but we got to open them so let's go ahead and pop this open so on this channel we had the original ones we even pulled a chase figure Man, that was some good times. That oh, was yeah. way back. Oh, and in the internet, yeah, that's might as well have been years. Jason Freeney was just getting Freeney. You mean, <laughs> <laughs> now he's Jason Pay Me. <laughs> Freeney. He ain't free no more because we also did the second one, which is the Grayscale SpongeBob Dissectables. Two, one. Oh! And the gold one! Oh, yeah. That was so sick. I love the gold one. I actually have a whole SpongeBob gold section over here, but we'll have to wait to see that one day. There was a third iteration. The me edition. We opened that oh one too. Oh, oh, you were right. It's Imagination Spongebob. Mr. Freeney. You are just laboring away. <laughs> Take a break. His eyes are x-rays. <laughs> <laughs> he just looks at something and he sees his anatomy. But we have one more anatomy vision from Jason Freeney. And I think this might be my favorite one they've ever done. Let me show you the front of it and see if you can get any idea of what we're working with here. Does that look Wait familiar to you? That does look familiar. What is that? He defends against... No way. Every villain's is lemons. <laughs> All right, so this whole box is themed after the International Justice League of Super Acquaintances episode of SpongeBob, which is absolutely iconic. So who is your favorite? The Quickster? Or was it Captain Magma? Right. Or was it the Elastic Waistband? Or was it Misappear? Which one's your favorite, Parker? What the hell? What are you doing? When I reappear, I just flop on the floor. Stores hate me. <laughs> <laughs> it's even worse when I'm naked. All right. So who's your favorite of those guys? Mm. Mermaid Man's in the crew too. Or Barnacle Man! How is that adult-sized Krabby Patty treating you, Barnacle Man? I honestly, like, Captain Magma is just, it's too funny. Yeah, it's too fucking funny. It's just, it's so personal to Squidward, you yeah, know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. What <laughs> about right. you? I'm not gonna go with the Quickster. SpongeBob is obviously my favorite character, and not just that, I always like quick characters. It's always sick to see them running fast. Yeah, yeah. So let's go ahead and get this open. Yeah. And always, man, always, the boxes are so freaking clean. I can't wait till the collection room is done so I can start showing you guys different things for reference, because in the room, I already have the box of the second series of Dissectimals, because I love the box so much, I have to put it in the room. Oh my god! What if I told you? What? It's not just the heroes in this set. No way! Dude, I see on the side here Man Ray! We have Man Ray! <laughs> Finally some Man Ray love! <laughs> oh my god, I want to get inside this box and ship myself to Mighty Jack and give him a hug myself. God damn! We finally have a Man Ray figure! Green, I think the only Man Ray figure that we have is like from a Fisher's Price toy. The only thing like reminiscent of Man Ray was when we found that wallet. And that guy just 
wouldn't take it back and had his ID in there. We know it was Mr. What's It To You. I found this ID in this wallet. And if that's the case, this must be your wallet. That makes sense to me. Then take it. It's not my wallet. All right, but let's pop this open. Ryan will put all of them on screen. You guys are looking at them right now. We got Man Ray, Dirty Bubble, and a rare Dirty Bubble, it looks like. Oh, dude, you got a rare Miss Appear. I bet it's translucent. Oh, and there's a rare Quickster, too. Okay, so we gotta get at least one of these rares. That would be freaking legendary. All right, let's pop it open. Whoa, my damn. Jack. That is a beautiful sight. I cannot say it enough. We got my Jack, 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 my Jack. My Jack. Hey, don't you fucking touch my Jack. He's been in a box for a while. I don't want you coming around touching him. <laughs> All right, so we got 12. How many is in the set? Well, nine. Ooh, with some good chances. Yeah, yeah. That's what I like to see. I like that a lot. That means we have a good chance. That means there's only three possible doubles then. Okay. Go ahead and crack the seal on this bad boy. Ooh. You see that mist come out when we opened it? Damn. Dude, the freaking stand is the International League of Justice Super Acquaintances symbol. It's a long name. We gotta talk to him on the TV. We have this TV over here. It's a SpongeBob TV. We can talk to literally anybody. We're gonna have to talk to the freaking commissioner. <laughs> and he makes a good point. <laughs> he does. <laughs> All right, so here we go. Who are you calling first off? I am hoping to God it is Man Ray and his wallet. Um, I really want to see Captain Magma. You got Captain Magma. I just noticed there's no Mermaid Man because Mermaid Man was in the first wave. Yeah, we already have oh, Mermaid Man. Let's okay. get him. Eva! We have Mermaid Man right here. This is what I love about being in the collectibles room is I can just grab anything for reference. But let's do it. It's, it's Miss Appear. Now you see her. Now you don't. Oh my god, dude. Look at how good the molding is on her. Holy crap. She had every rib removed to get that Bill Cipher shape. <laughs> <laughs> that, that is was... freaking sweet. I love her face. Like the way they did like the attitude in it. I love that one so much. Let's go ahead and put it on the stand. And of course, since the second series as well, they come with these cards. So right here we have the Miss Appear card to go with it. I gotta say, man, that is freaking sweet right there. Yeah, if you don't have one or the other, what's the point? If you don't have this car, you might as well throw this away. <laughs> All right, let's see who we got. Man, I can't wait for that big old fart bubble. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. I don't want to look at the car, obviously. This one feels more flat. <gasps> oh! Yes! yes! Here we go. Okay, so that can't be a rare. But I have waited, literally as a SpongeBob fan. I've been looking for a Man Ray figure for so long. Definitely the sickest villain in all of SpongeBob, in my opinion. And honestly, one of the funniest. Yeah, dude. I love that scene where he's like frozen inside the Mermel Lair. Let's go ahead and pull this out. And yes, dude, Man Ray! <laughs> oh my God. This has taken so long. You know what I learned from this is look at his anatomy. What does that remind you of? Skeletor? It's a human being. Oh yeah, that was a blood. I know, but like we never see him without the mask. So essentially, you know, oh. the dirty bubble, he's a bubble. Uh, all the other characters are fish or something like that. But we never knew if Man Ray was some kind of Man Ray. Dude. No, I get you, I get you. Because like there's not a lot of humanoid figures other than Mermaid Man. And Barnacle Boy. So he's like a direct arch nemesis. That is insane. I love the Man Ray so much. Beautiful figure. Let's go ahead and put him on the stand. All right, right next to Miss Appear, Wait we a got. I'm Man sorry. Ray. I just, I just noticed that the color coordination is just like Barnacle Boy. What if it's like Barnacle Boy wasn't his original sidekick? I think that's a job for Alex Bells, Parker. I mean, imagine. That's why he's against Mermaid Man. <laughs> I'm staying my lamb. Open the next box. But here we go. We got Man Ray. So we got two characters in. Oh, we got seven left. Let's do it. All right. I'm gonna try and pull it out this way because I almost saw the card last time. Don't feel it. Oh, wow. Good quality plastic. Yeah. Oh, oh my yes. God. Yes, I know who it is. The fire is coming. Yes. Ryan, put some steam on the screen. Krakatawa! <laughs> That's amazing. He's literally mid Krakatawa. That is freaking brilliant, dude. And the freaking volcano on his head, man. <laughs> Let's go ahead and grab our shield. Okay. There we go. We got Squid, man. And we have him right there there, full-blown Krakatawa. And again, guys, soon we'll have a table. We won't be doing everything on the floor. <laughs> it's just right now, this is the setup we got, and I wanted to get these open for you guys. Look at that lineup, dude. I love the way the stands actually connect, because up until this time, they had always been circular stands, just like
like these, you know, they don't feel like unified. This, you can just put them in a straight line. Captain Magma. Yes, sir, right there. Captain Magma card right in front of him. Oh, I love the way the cards look with the figures. Okay, man. So we haven't got a chase yet either. So when I saw him disappear, I was like, okay, that could have been the chase, but it doesn't look like different from the character from the show. So it has to be something. I, I'm hoping translucent, like you said. I didn't even make sense. What? Damn. What? It better be translucent. <laughs> you made a promise. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Is it circular? Is it no. Spherical? You want to see me open it again? Wow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here it is. I think this is the Quickster. It's the Quickster. Yeah. Oh my God, that looks so fucking good, dude. Get it off, get it off, get it off, get it off. Holy shit. Dude, look, at it's like tinted. That's fucking crazy. It's translucent. The actual glasses are translucent. And I gotta say, I mean, even the divots inside of his actual porpoise holes are actually freaking there comparatively to the original one. Okay, let's go ahead and put the stand on Damn, him. Oh man. But There's like so much said, real estate. He kind of reminds me, his costume kind of reminds me of Man Ray too. Hmm. Uncanny similarities. <laughs> I would like to know other people's thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Boom, man. I love it. I gotta move her over here now. That is so freaking oh, sweet, man. dude. That is really cool. Let's go ahead and grab that card out. Boom, the Quickster. I think I gotta say, this might be my favorite one. I think this is my favorite one of the Jason Freeney designed ones so far. I think it's cool because all the humanoid-esque kind of ones, they're really skinny because that's their body size, but yeah. you, see, you get you get like a really big figure in this one. Yeah, exactly. I think what it is too is like, you know, there's a lot of SpongeBob figures, you know, we get these and they're awesome and I love them so much, and especially these ones. Look at that, suck the cup down. Oh. But the thing is, is these ones are just like so thematic to an episode. And it's just like, it so embodies like the whole superhero era. Yeah, it's one of the greatest episodes. Absolutely. Can we talk about the fact that they had freaking Lemons, which is this logo right here, before the Avengers had this logo right here with Hydra? They had called out Hydra as Lemons before anybody. Okay. Ooh, this one feels big. It let's... could be the bubble. Yeah, it feels like there's protectors around it. Bubble. Yeah, let's see it. Oh. Oh! oh! Yes! Oh my god! Wow, that is so sick! Wow. Dude, that like instantly became a favorite. This is Mighty Jack. Hello, I like money. <laughs> take it, my card, take my fucking credit card, take it. I mean, I know you sent it for free, but I want to pay for them now. That is so freaking sick, dude. That is brilliant, the way they had his legs actually go around. That was what he did in the episode, you know? Like, that was the way he displayed his power. I can finally touch my toes. <laughs> Dude, and then the whole dissectable goes in around oh, the entire loop. Dude. That's disgusting. That's awesome. That's awesome, but disgusting. You can see his bones stretched all the way to the end. That is my favorite one. Yeah, no, seriously, yeah. it became like an instant favorite. I'm like, look at this thing. And I like how they chose like a perfect moment, you know? Ah, uh, yeah. I gotta say, I really love the man ray because we haven't had a man ray figure, but we're just talking about the dynamics of it and everything, man. I gotta go with freaking the elastic waistband. Because it's kind of hard to encapsulate their power in a statue. Yeah, but they managed to do it with him, you know, mid Krakatawa, and then they got him in the stretch. Yeah, you can't beat it. Okay, so interruption. Speaking of Patrick, maybe a couple videos ago, we got this Patrick snaps figure, and I put it on top of Parker's car. Let's get an update, see if it's still on his roof. As you guys can hear, it's raining outside, so I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so it's raining, and we came out here. It was gone. It was gone. And we were like probably on the side of the road somewhere, and then I started walking away, and I look at your needing to be changed windshield. Wipers. Can I see? Dude literally jumped for his life, probably in a red light. It was like, <laughs> that's way safer of a spot. All right, so we can say that it successfully went on several car rides without a seatbelt. Who needs them? All right, we still haven't pulled the chase though yet. I have no clue. Like, I have no clue what the chases look like in this series. So I'm super excited to pull any of them. If we get one, that'd be amazing. But hey, we all we need is one more of the regular. Yeah, all we need is Dirty Bubble, and we have the regular series. <laughs> Okay, didn't see the card. It Feels. doesn't look bubble-like, though. It doesn't look spherical. Okay, what do we got here? Mer oh, we got freaking Man Ray. We got our first duplicate. I can't disrespect the Freeney design and throw this one across the room, but what I will do is use our Nickelodeon basketball hoop to go for the Man Ray double swish. 
our single switch. Okay, next one up. Hopefully next time we have a double switch, we get another duplicate. But I, I just can't throw these Jason Freeney ones across the room. I just can't do it to him. I mean, especially because that's, that was the one figure we've been asking for. Yeah, exactly. Okay, okay. Thank God I didn't see the card. Oh my God. Oh, that looks a little bubbly. Oh, who else could it be? Bumbling, stumbling. <laughs> this is gonna be Bubble Bass or Dirty Bubble. Let's or Mrs. Find... Puff. <laughs> yeah, mid post car crash, Mrs. Puff. <laughs> Let's see who we got. Why, SpongeBob? <laughs> I think I know who we got. All right. Oh! Dude, dude, that dude. is sick! What the hell? Uh, the freaking jawbone right here? Who told him to go this hard? This is insane, dude. Why is this my, like, possibly my new favorite? <laughs> the dirty, the filthy, the grotesque, vile, <laughs> filled bubble! <laughs> Make him eat dirt! <laughs> <laughs> That's like my favorite. It's making me dirt. <laughs> All right, our very, very important member of Lemons, the Dirty Bubble. So there it is. We have the entire baseline of the figures. So here we are. We got both the villains and our group of super associates <laughs> right there. All right, man. Now we got five boxes left, and the only thing we're aiming for is bangers. I think if I got a Dirty Bubble, I'd definitely make. A double switch. <laughs> is that your new favorite? Honestly, because I mean, imagine how hard it was to capture a bubble, a translucent natured bubble. The only thing I would have said is like, I would have liked the dirty bubble a little translucent. To me, this like almost, what is it, a chocolate bonbon? Yeah, like from the back, it does look like a cocoa puff, but I mean, I think it's really cool the way they captured it. Yeah, absolutely. And they did put the shine on there for sure to try and make it a little bit more translucent. But let's see what we got next here. Oh, this is a big box. Oh, I see. Oh. Oh, oh, I see. Oh, 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 oh you're freaking me oh, out. Oh, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. What do we got here? You son of a bitch. No. <laughs> Stupid asshole. Why the fuck did you tell me that? I saw yellow. Oh, hey, you we got me so fucking. <laughs> I was so Wait, ready. Was so what? <laughs> Bruh. Oh, hey, that huh, hunt for this. <laughs> Man, what am I doing? This goes in the fucking double switch. <laughs> Double switch. All right, welcome back to No Dupe City. Our freaking bailiff now understands the guidelines. <laughs> hey man, you never know. I just thought like, hey, it was yellow. It could be. Uh, I know. But I thought you saw something. I thought you saw some shine on I it. I saw so. some yellow. <laughs> All right, next time I'll react when I see some. Uh oh. No. Say that way. The elastic waistband. Man, why does something that's your favorite become not your favorite when you get dupe? <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna roll into a soccer goal. <laughs> Hey, we got three, three left. Three. Oh, unless all of them are chases. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man, we can possibly. If we get one, one chase. All I right, want manifest it, be, it. If we can pick one, which one do you want to pick? I want to pick. Well, I gotta go with the ultra rare. The other one's just rare. If we get the quickster, then that's ultra rare. If we get misappear or dirty bubble, they're just rare. Okay. Well, I mean, I would like to see the dirty bubble. Yeah, I would love to see that as well. But I, I gotta go with the super rare because yeah, I don't have to pay for the other ones online. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see what we got here. Okay, so this is Sandrell. But is it a common Sandrail? Let's see it. We're gonna drop it in three, two, one. Oh. Is it the same? Oh, they're identical. <laughs> <laughs> oh, damn. All right, next one. Oh, you didn't throw it. Where'd it go? I heard it land. All right. <laughs> next one. Let's do it. Please, magic bag. Can I have a chase? No. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh, oh, shit, that one's broken. All right, we got Krakatawa again. We got one box left. Dang. I don't know, I thought like maybe there was gonna be at least one or two chases. Well, I mean, you're probably only gonna get one chase. If that, if this isn't a chase, then we only got the main set and I gotta buy a lot online. That, well, you got the main set. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna go all in on Dirty Bubbler and uh, Ultra wrong. Rare. Oh, well, okay. I think I'm gonna go with Ultra Rare Manifest. Yeah, let's go with Ultra Rare Manifested. Here we go. Oh, wait, Ooh, I see. Oh, oh! Now that is freaking sick. We have the translucent misappear. That's perfect. That, yep. I'm okay with that being the last one. That is so freaking sick. Now you guys know that I gotta get the Quickster Ultra Rare, and I also have to get the other Dirty Bubble variation. But man, oh man, Look I am content with freaking Sandy Cheeks right there. Misappear. Not just that. This is Misappear Crystal. <laughs> Sounds like she's trying to take my money and run. <laughs> 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 Sounds like she drives a Mercedes or dad bought her. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like about 60 bucks a song. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're done with that. But 
I gotta say, I mean, yeah, we didn't get the entire set, but at least we got the mainline set and we got one of the chases. We just need two chases left to finish this set, which you guys know I'm gonna do. So, that is freaking it for this one, guys. That was absolutely amazing. We got a man ray, we got a freaking elastic waistband, we got even a chase. Make sure you guys smash that like button if you guys are new here. Make sure you subscribe because right now we're working on this room. Once this room's done, it's gonna be a whole different ballpark as far as how much content's gonna be coming out and how we're gonna be able to film it. But, make sure you guys subscribe. All that great stuff, you know the drill. Stay in it. But all right, guys, that is actually it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys subscribe. You guys do not want to miss any of the stuff coming on this channel. Like I said, this is the channel where I'm trying to create the world's biggest SpongeBob and Nickelodeon collection. So if you want to see more of that, make sure you guys are subscribed. And also check out this video on your screen right here, which is the video that I recommend for you. It's literally a shopping haul where I go to freaking Five Below and buy every single SpongeBob and Nickelodeon item we could find. Once you click on that, it'll put you on a shopping playlist, which I know you're going to enjoy. So I'll see you guys over there. And as always, Rep Pack, I'll see you, beautiful people. And the next one. Crocodile!